Yes, already starting recording. Starting recording once. ओके गैस गुड इवनिंग टू एवरीवन आ सी बेसिक गा मन की रोज मैडम उन्नरा मैडम ये रोज प्रेजेंटेट चेस्टा ना रो मैडम प्रेजेंटेशन चेस्टा रही रोज आ चेस्टन सर आई विल ट्राई मेरे लेवल बेस्ट या प्लीज गो आर ओके सर शेयर योर स्क्रीन एंड एक्सप्लेन द कॉन्सेप्ट ओके फिफ्टीन मिनट्स में ओके सर Okay, Sheikh Allah Bakhsh, uh, keep your uh, video off. Screen share in the sir. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Allah Bakhsh, keep your audio, uh, video off. Okay, so you can start. Okay, Great. उटरेपेड so we have to pay on next month first week in other simple words so uh, services already done but payment is not uh, done so that we can make the provision in every month ending so it is the month end activity in sap system for example salaries payable rent payable audit fee electricity payables like that so after that deferrals deferrals means it is also a provision and it is a expenses but in this case uh, uh, payment is done but services not at be uh, not at to be provided so here i can take the advance received uh, rent advance received salary advance received and in this situation outstanding liability which is i maintained in accruals so i can consider as a part of deferrals also so after that first uh, Uh, before going to uh, uh, what is that accruals and uh, deferrals postings first we can define the reversal reason so i can maintain i have maintained the reversal reason as a sa sa like this and accruals and deferrals reverse reverse underscore samsung it is the my company code so after okay. that uh, can you show uh, that in your system sorry sir yeah can you show that reversal reason in your system Uh, okay, instead sir. of uh, uh, sharing the screenshot, uh, just uh, show us that uh, 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 configuration, right? For reason, I say how it should be created. Just to show me an example. Okay, okay, sir. Okay. Okay, okay, sir. Now you can create new reason, not only I say. So just create new reason and uh, execute the transaction as well. Okay, okay, sir. Sure, sir. Yeah.
SPRB. This is the path only. So, SAP okay. reference IMG. SAP is not SAP, it's SAP, okay. Don't uh, speak SAP, okay, it's SAP. Okay. Financial accounting new. And general ledger accounting new. And business transactions. And adjustment posting are reversal. And it define reason for reversal. Here okay. we can create the reversal reason. So I have maintained a new entries like this. So reason uh, SA is my uh, first two characters in my company code. So I have uh, uh, so I can take some other so like um, MG like this. Accurals or difference difference. OK. Like this and we can check this box and we can select this box only and after that we can save it. So uh, like this only we have created the reversal reason. OK, sir, is it OK, sir? Yeah, fine, fine. OK, sir. After that, uh, can I go through PPT presentation or continue the here only? Sir? Just go through the, the PPT and uh, do it in your system, okay? okay Explain sir. critically in the uh, uh, PPT. Then okay. whatever screenshots uh, that uh, you can directly do it in your system. After that, we make the posting equitals difference with FBS1 transaction code. So wait, I can see in my system. This is the provisional entry for uh, window. So here uh, normally we can post the provisional entry on every month end. So I can take the 30th September 2022. So it is a document general document. So SA document type and company code SAMG and posting data also. I can take the 30th September 2022. So period it is the sixth period, right? So we can maintain a local currency. So that is the INR. OK, document number. It is all uh, system automatically generated once we posted the provisional entry. Reverse um, rent. Rent for provisional entry. So document header text is also the same. See, generally provisions are current liabilities, right? Yes, sir. Uh, actually, I have maintained, no? So... Okay. So, what is the entry you are posting right now? So, just uh, show me in the uh, PPT. Okay, sir. So, what is the entry right now you are posting? Uh, just uh, show us. So, actually, here uh, I have maintained salary like this only, sir. So, uh, after posted, uh, we can see the entry like this rent uh, account data to outstanding expenses or salary account data to outs outstanding expenses. We can see like that only. OK, so for outstanding expenses, you already created GL account. Right? Yeah, uh, outstanding okay. expenses I have already created as a liability uh, under current liability. One double zero five double zero. Yes, show us that the GL account. How you okay. created? OK, sir. First, we open the FS00 screen. So it is the current liability option. So I created new GL. So 100500 already I have created. So uh, so that only it was uh, showing like this. You just double click on that item. Okay? Uh, 100500 outstanding okay. expenses. So yeah, it is the the under current liability provision. And okay. short text is outstanding expenses, outstanding expenses account. In control mm -hmm. data, so only balances in local currency. So account mm -hmm. currency is the INR. And I have selected the open item management. It is the open item and the line item okay. display and sort key. Okay. And uh, after that, create and bank interest, I have maintained the Z001 field status group. Okay. And save it. Bye. Okay. What is next? 
so can I go through this, sir? Yeah. Means, uh, okay. You can so, take the reversal uh, result. There is no created, right? The reversal yes. result is just taken. Chalu, sir, let me have a quick, quick question. Share itself. Can I go? So Anyone asking anything right now? Um, uh, Chandu, sir, Manvi, how did you, uh, you know, open the uh, period six? Did you open period the period six? I already closed the, I already closed the September period in OB 52. But mm -hmm. for this purpose only, I uh, reopened for September. Okay, reopened. Okay, okay. That uh, sixth period is coming automatically, right? You are not giving any anything in the system. No, sir, but actually, okay, this you are, you are coming out of hmm. See, I think it's seventh, right? Uh, why the system is showing as six, which valid the uh, question that uh, she reopened, she reopened the period uh, under T called OB 52 and no, then no, no. sixth and seventh periods I opened. No, no, so, do one uh, thing. September and October for uh, two periods, I can post any entry. Uh, in mean? September and October months. I got it, madam. Uh, but uh, the question is, sir, you are posting in the 3009, right? Mm. Okay, so ninth period is right now sixth. Okay, so you are posting in back periods, not in current date. Okay, exactly. right, correct, correct, correct. Fine, just go ahead. Mm. So is it possible in the, you know, the current in scenario? Post previous in real time, it is uh, not possible, but right. in tracking system, it is the possible. Uh, yeah. Right. See, mm. For the demo perspective, we are doing like that. Uh, but real time it should be different, okay? So we need to open the previous, uh, so previous period is already closed, okay? But mm -hmm. uh, for the demo perspective, she is showing like that, okay? She will, she will post reversal entry on 10th, maybe, I think, I guess. Okay, mm -hmm. reversal date. Just for my Sir, so can we reversal post? is an MG, uh, just now I have uh, taken this. And the reversal Correct. date is, I want to reverse that particular document on 1st October. Correct. Uh, sir, I have a doubt. So, can we post future entry, sir? Future uh, uh, entry, future posting date. Can we put future posting date and post the entry today? Is it possible in SAP? See, Maybe in real it is time, possible. what happened? Uh, we need to open the current period only. Uh, but these things are coming up in month ending activities, right? So, in month end time, uh, so we need to create this, and we should be remove. We should be reversal in the next month. Okay. So, that case, it should be work out. Okay. Madam, okay, what okay. Madam doing is hundred percent uh, fine. Uh, there is no problem. Oh, so in the normal case, we cannot post only in the case of uh, this open line but items. This, uh, this is the month ending activity. Approval and deferral is a month ending activity. She has made some provision in uh, this month, but this should be reversed in the next month. Okay. So next month should be happen once the periods are open. Okay. 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 But, so posting is 40. 40 yeah. is the debit. So uh, here we uh, we can see the entry like a salary or rent, whatever expenditure is the debit and outstanding expenses should be the credit. So okay. I can take the four double zero three double zero. So it is the I think uh, rent. So I can take uh, fifteen thousand. And value date is thirtieth uh, September, which is the posting or document date. And the rent provision. Okay. Posting. And now and you posting can post. is the 50. It is the credit balance, credit line item. Mm -hmm. And credit is the out, outstanding expenses. No, so 100, 500. I should take that outstanding expenses. Enter. And copy the before line item. Uh, and value date 30th September. And star and plus indicators we can copy from before line item. Uh, this and enter. So go to document and simulate. So rent account data to outstanding expenses. This is the provisional entry at every month ending. So and we can save it. So this document 16 was posted in company code SAMG like this only. So once okay. we posted the provisional entry, we can reverse the document with F dot F dot 81. Yes. Company code. So uh, 
further selections reverse posting date we can maintain we have maintained uh, 1st uh, october and execute 16th is the uh, just now i have maintained rent project these uh, two all uh, one second so uh, this one only just i have entered like this rent provision so here a reverse document is option there no so i i can click on reverse document so already reversed reverse with the document okay reverse the document with the 17 right yes sir yeah, but, just uh, go to AP03 and uh, give 17. Okay. Okay. No, no, just click enter. Okay, just go back and uh, give. Go back, go back, go back. Just go back. Enter. Ah, give the 17 and enter. Give 17 number. Okay, enter, enter, enter only. No need to click that. Just click enter. Enter, madam. Just go back. Yes. Ah, enter, uh, yes, no, sir. But specify another selection criteria also. Not required. Uh, just go back and click enter. Then automatically coming, right? We don't want to give any specification. Just go back. Sir, it, uh, it yeah, just click on escape. Sorry, escape button. Look, yeah, click okay. Fine, go back and base zero three. Yes, 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 like this only. See, entire details I don't want. Okay, just go back slash n fb zero three. Just type down slash n fb zero three. Yeah. Uh, give the 17 document. Enter. Enter, enter, enter. Don't click that. Enter. Okay, okay, sir. Yeah. Okay. okay, see, rent account data are outstanding. This is yes, a reversal sir. entry, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Outstanding expenses data to rent account. Yeah. So, this is the okay. reversal entry. Okay. Uh, so, reversal uh, entry is... system will so... be automatically posted. Got it, got it. Show me uh, in your uh, PPT. So, what is the entries that you have presented? Okay. Like this only, sir. Okay. Outstanding okay. expenses to rent account and outstanding expenses to salary account. Okay, fine, fine. Thank you, thank you. Nice explanation, madam. Thank you. And uh, so, I just want to know who is the end user over here. How many end users?